어디서 만나고 싶어? Where do you want to meet? Where do you want to meet? Where do you want to meet? 공원에서 만나자. Let's meet at the park. Let's meet at the park. Let's meet at the park. 그거 어디 있어? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? 그거 2층에 있어. It's on the second floor. It's on the second floor. It's on the second floor. 탁구 치는 거 어때? How about playing table tennis? How about playing table tennis? How about playing table tennis? 그래. Sure. 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 오마이 스피킹과 초코 언니만 있다면 영어로 자신 있게 말할 수 있어. Is Choco Honey here with your Oh My Speaking? Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my classroom. So today is a good day today because we are about to begin the very last book of Oh My Speaking. Oh my goodness, it is the last book. Book, the very last book. <gasps> How exciting! You're about to conquer the Omas Kingdom. The Omas Kingdom is yours now. <gasps> Yay! You should be very proud of yourself, and I'm so, so, so proud of you. Okay, so some of you might begin unit one, two, three, or might be four, and I wish you the best. Let's go ahead and begin. You're almost there. Wish you the best. Today's expression. 오늘의 표현. 무언가를 하자고 제안할 때쓸수 있는 표현. 쇼핑하는 거 어때? How about going shopping? How about going shopping? How about going shopping? 어떤 장소가 몇 층에 있는지 말할 때쓸수 있는 표현. 그것은 5층에 있어. It's on the fifth floor. It's on the fifth floor. It's on the fifth floor. 오마이 스피킹 How about playing table tennis tomorrow? Sounds good. How about having lunch before the game? Okay. Where do you want to meet? Let's meet at King's Burger. Sure. Where is it? It's on the second floor of that building. Okay. I see it. See you there at 12. Alrighty, welcome back to your story time, guys. I have waited for you for so long. Let's take you straight into the story. Today, uh, Jack and Tom are in the story. They make a fun plan to play the table tennis. They're trying to find the meeting spot, the King's Burger. Let's see where the King's Burger is. Ready? So Tom begins by saying, Hi, Jack. How about playing table tennis tomorrow? 안녕, Jack. 내일. 탁구 치는 거 어때? Hi Jack, how about playing table tennis tomorrow? Hmm. And Jack says, sounds good. 좋은 생각이야. Sounds good. Second picture, Tom says, how about having lunch before the game? 하기 전에, 우리 게임하기 전에 어, 점심 먹는 거 어때? How about having lunch before the game? How about having lunch before the game? Sounds good. And Jack says, Okay, where do you want to meet? 음, 좋아. 어디서 만날까? Okay, where do you want to meet? Mm -hmm. And Tom says, Let's meet at King's Burger. King's Burger에서 만나자. Let's meet at King's Burger. Wow, burger for lunch sounds so good, right? And Jack says, Sure, where is it? 좋아. 어디지? Sure, where is it? 
where is Kingsburger? And Tom kindly explains where the Kingsburger is. Uh, Tom says, it's on the second floor of that building. 저 빌딩의 2층에 있어. It's on the second floor of that building. It's on the second floor of that building. All right. And Jack says, okay, I see it. Oh, I guess so. 나 보인다. Okay, I see it. See you there at 12. 우리 12시에 봐. See you there at 12. 거기서 12시에 봐. See you there at 12. Awesome job, everyone. Hope you guys have fun reading the story. And Kingsburger for lunch sounds really good, right? <laughs> Moving on to vocabulary. Here I am with more vocabulary words. Are you guys ready? You guys did a wonderful job on practicing the key pattern. Now it's time to learn more vocab words to put it in our key patterns. Are you guys ready? So we learned how to suggest doing something, right? So let's start. My first choice is going to the theater. One more time. Going to the theater. What is theater? That's correct. It's the place where we go to watch movies. That's right. Going to the theater. 영화관에 가다. Going to the theater. Okay, let's put it in our key pattern. Mm. Oh, 영화관 가는 거 어때? How about going to the theater? One more time. How about going to the theater? How about going to the theater? Hmm. Now, let's go ahead and look at the building right here. Where is the theater? Which floor has theater? Hmm. It's on the fourth floor. Where's the theater? It's on the fourth floor. 그건 4층에 있어. It's on the fourth floor. One more time. It's on the fourth floor. Awesome job! And my second choice is, oh, my favorite thing, buying a present. One more time, buying a present. 선물을 사는 것. Buying a present. Buying a present. Awesome. Let's put it in our key pattern. Oh, 선물을 사러 가는 것 어때? How about buying a present? One more time. How about buying a present? By yourself, how about buying a present? Faster, how about buying a present? How about buying a present? Awesome job! Now, where is the toy store? Let's say that we're buying a present, we're buying the toys for our present. Did you find the toy store in this building? That's right, it is on the first floor, right? 그곳은 1층에 있어. It's on the first floor. One more time. It's on the first floor by yourself. It's on the first floor. Good job, everybody. You guys did a wonderful job. Now moving on to listen and check. Welcome back to your listen and check. All right, get your safe pen ready. We're going to start from activity A to C. Ready? Number one. A. How about going to the theater? B. How about having a burger? All right, did you guys listen carefully? Before we talk about the answers, take a look on this picture. What do you see? That's right, we see a burger. And where do we buy the burger? That's correct, at a fast food restaurant. Now you can go over the answer. A, it says, how about going to the theater? How about going to the theater? All right. B, it says, how about having a burger? How about having a burger? Hamburger, burger. Which one is the answer? That's right, B is the answer. So you're going to put the circle on B. Awesome job. Now on to activity B. Where is it? Listen and write the number. Are you guys ready? Number one. Number one. How about having Chinese food? Okay. Where's the Chinese restaurant? It's on the third floor. Okay, so let's go over the question and the answer together. It says, 
how about having Chinese food? <gasps> nom 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 nom. So good, right? I love Chinese food. Anyway, how about having Chinese food? And the answer for the reply is that okay. Where's the Chinese restaurant? Hmm. Where's the Chinese restaurant? Which floor has Chinese restaurant? And it was. It's on the third floor. Which floor has it? That's correct. The third floor. So this time you're going to write three on number one. The third floor. Third floor. Good job. Good job. Good job. Moving on to activity. See now is your true or false question. So listen to the conversation carefully, and we're going to select if it's true or false. Ready? How about having lunch tomorrow? Okay. Where do you want to meet? Let's meet at King's Burger. Sure. Where is it? It's on the second floor of that building. Okay. I see it. See you there at twelve. Number one. Jack will have lunch with mom tomorrow. Number two. King's Burger is on the second floor. Number three. Jack and his friend will meet at two p.m. tomorrow. Okay, so did you guys listen to the conversation carefully? Let's go over and see if the statement is true or false. Starting from the first statement, it says, "Jack will have lunch with mom tomorrow." Is it true or false? Who's he having his lunch with? Do you guys remember? That's right, his friend Tom. So, is this true or false? Is it true or false? That's right, it is false because he's having. Lunch with Tom. So go ahead and put the check mark on false. Good job. The second statement it says King's Burger is on the second floor of the building. Was that true or false? Is it true or false? Good job. It is true. The King's Burger was on the second floor. So go ahead and put the check mark on true. Good job. Good job. The last statement. Are you guys ready? Jack and his friend will meet at two p.m. tomorrow. Hmm. Do you guys remember the time they supposed to meet? It was not two p.m. It was twelve o'clock. Good job. So it is false because it's a false information. So go ahead and put check mark on false. Now we're done for today's unit. Congratulations! I'm so proud of you. I can see your English improving every day. All right, then I'll see you on the next unit. See you later, alligator. All the children of Oma's kingdom spoke English happily ever after. The end.